Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome, welcome, welcome back to another Monday, which means it is time for another Nas Watches Vinland Saga. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So, in our last episode, uh, Ask, Ask a Chad mm, was getting his butt cheeks clapped a little bit. Everyone was like, hey, Askeladd's been making a lot of really head-ass decisions. Maybe we should murder him and take the prince for our own and maybe join up with Thorkel, because it seems like Thorkel's been, you know, living it up, doing pretty good. So yeah, now Askeladd's gonna deal with the fact that apparently 90% of his army has completely lost faith in him and think that he is an absolute fucking head-ass shit dick. But, hey... It's just how it be sometimes. Let's see how Askeladd gets out of this, if he gets out of it at all. He's probably going to get out of it, even though, honestly, at this point, yeah, no, they're kind of right. He's kind of been doing the dumbest shit possible for the last couple episodes, and it's kind of getting a little annoying. But, hey, there we be. We're, uh, we're on episode 17, so, hey, we still got... We still got quite a few to work with here, so we can see how this first season ends. In three... So let's get at it. Let's get going on this in three, two, one, and go. Oh boy, hi motorcycle. Like, like I, I, I'm not like I, I like this show. I really do. But there's like a lot of decisions here that I'm just like, come on, chief. Oh god, why is it so far back? Ah, why is it? Why is it set to gamer position? Like, oh man, it's all the spears. It's all their spears glinting in the sunlight. Oh man, oh jeez. So we're just recapping in. Oh no, he's just gonna be... Yeah, there it is. Why are the guys in the back CG? Why is everyone CG? Oh man, when they betrayed him, everyone turned CG. You know, as you know, Thorfinn, if you want to kill Askeladd, this would be the perfect time to throw your law in and do it. I mean, if he killed Askeladd, he could probably take over as leader of the army. And I think Thorkell. I think Thorkel would really like it having his having his nephew his nephew like join up with him with an army. I don't know, chief. Uh, Thorfinn's gonna do something stupid, isn't he? I'm I'm waiting for it. Thorfinn's gonna do something stupid. Oh boy. Like, that was... That was- that was the face of someone who's about to do something stupid. Can't wait. Can't fucking wait. Oh boy. Alright. Like... Askeladd's been making so many poor decisions... And... Like, the last few episodes, and the only thing keeping him alive is... Literally plot armor? Which is just really kind of annoying. <sighs> um, if I'm gonna be honest, I think Askeladd should be dead by now. Honestly, with the amount of stupid shit he's he's been doing. And honestly, if Thorfinn really wanted Askeladd dead, which he super does, this would be the time. This would super be the time. Askeladd has lost... Askeladd has lost the confidence of his men. He is... Which means he is... Ascent, if you want, you want him dead, you've got to do it soon. Otherwise, the, it will just take care of itself. If everybody piles in against Askeladd... Like, what, what's Thorfinn going to do? Is he going to defend Askeladd? Or is he going to go in for the kill? Ugh. It just... Oh, man. Like, I feel like... This series could have gone, like, a complete different way.
Avalon isn't the name of heaven. I don't think. The fuck? Yeah, it's not heaven, it's just a mythical land, yeah. It's where the Fey hang out. Oh god, they got their titties out! Shit! Oh boy. And what is it with, like, all the fucking, like, all the fucking myths from. And now it's got the plague. Now that soup's got the plague. All of all of the myths from the British Isles, it ends with someone either going off to a mythical land where they'll heal and come back, or they go into a tree to hang out. Kukulain, hanging out in a tree until Ireland needs it. Merlin, hanging out in a tree until until England needs him. Arthur, went to Avalon to come back when he's needed. Fucking... Like, how many trees in England just have ancient heroes of old just fucking just taking a nap inside? Because it's more than a few. Yeah, and now you're just making the problem worse. You're, you're literally just... There is, a, there is an issue, and you are just continuing to exacerbate the issue. Oh! Oh, you're just ripping the fucking band-aid off now, huh? Jesus Christ, Ascalad! He, well, he's gonna kill his, in, his entire army? And there's some ninja shit, alright. Thorfinn! How in the fuck, like... And isn't Thorfinn a Dane? And so is Bjorn or whatever the fuck his name is. They're all Danes, like... Unless he's like, oh no, they're some of the good ones. I hate all Danes, but not you, Thorfinn and Bjorn. You guys are some of the good ones. Wait, why are they killing each other? That's my job! <laughs> hey, how dare they kill each other without me! Come on! Ugh... I mean, seeing Thorkel versus Askeladd would be pretty neat. Though, I kind of would like to have seen, um, Thorfinn and Thorkel actually hang out, you know? Yeah, he already used them all! <laughs> Like, he's a Dane. Like, Askeladd already said, like, he fucking hates him. Like, seriously, like, that was some fucking Sylvanas Windrunner shit. And I don't mean the good Sylvanas Windrunner, I mean the shitty one that they- that they're making right now. Askeladd, trust me, he hates my race, but he loves me, it's fine.
God, Bjorn, you really- Jesus! Man, Bjorn's confidence really... Really collapsed fast, didn't it? You know what would've- that what would've prevented the horses from getting killed like that? Imagine if Thorfinn had a weapon that had reach. Like a spear. Or something useful. Oh no, he hurt his little trap legs. You tore his programmer socks. Oh shit, he's messing up! It's time for meth! Oh, boy. Like, the modern equivalent would be, like, he re li pulls up his sleeve, there's just, like, a line of cocaine on it that he's just got stuck there. Just like, Alright, fuckers, let's go! Jesus Christ, Askeladd. That's a lot of dead guys. Escalade, you son of a bitch, you best not die until I kill you. God, that's the worst anime fucking thing I've ever I've ever read. Holy shit. Who would have thought I wouldn't be able to kill 50 men in one go? Man, these Dynasty Warriors games are getting harder. He's not even- Je Jesus Christ! Just- Straight up, just fucking right, right through that man's skull. Like, he's just cleaving through people like butter. Oh, hey. For once, armor works. And then it doesn't. Man, armor sure is mysterious, huh? Man, it's almost man, it's almost as if it, he's got some magical Roman bullshit. Fucking Baka Gaijin, glorious Roman steel folded five thousand times, <laughs> cut through the Danes like butter. Why didn't you just shoot him in the first place? Man's got a sword. This is where Thorfinn's gonna come back and fuck everything up for everyone, isn't he? Thorfinn's gonna show up and he's gonna fuck everything up. Oh, almost. Almost. He, he could have done it. He could have fucking done it. Oh, God, that would have been so hype if he did, though. Just do a sick combat roll, grab a shield. <laughs> Why doesn't he have a shield in the first place? Is it because he's a protagonist? You guys are the ones that started it, Jesus.
What are you waiting for? <sighs> really? Really? He's trying to summon King Arthur, is that... Or is he speaking metaphorically? Please tell me he doesn't mean he's trying to literally summon King Arthur. You dipshits, you took too long. You took too fucking long, chief. That's the face of a real happy boy. Fucking Thorkel is such a good boy, such a good happy boy. Man, they made it, they got there real fucking quick. Just booked it over the river. You threw down your weapons. He's not gonna resist. Oh well. <laughs> just fucking. Not even with his axe, just with his bare hands. Thor. Thorkel's very upset. Ten men that are all fucking horseless now. <laughs> just the loom, just... Like, that needs some fucking menacing kanji right there, god damn. Where's my nephew? Where he at? Where he go? Yeah, he's a good boy. Thorfinn the good boy. Thorkel's so proud. It's what you get for being cowards, chief! Fucking Viking rules! Cowards die! Like... I would straight up... Like, I, I want more- I want some- I want fucking Thorfinn and Thorkel hanging out. Maybe Thorkel could, like, you know... Turn him into an actual fucking character. You know? And also, I feel like Thorfinn maybe needs a little bit of family. He's like, you know, a little bit of family going on here. I mean, that's the last time he was interesting, when he was in Iceland with his family. Nah, it's fine, I'll get him. He's good, Chief. It's fine. I mean, hey, there's always a chance you win. Like, hey, man, there's always a chance. There's always a chance you could win.
Seriously, like, all these guys, they're just kind of going like, Oh, man, no, I'm going to die. It's like... I mean, Thorfinn has shown like, that this is, in this show, size difference means fucking nothing. Oh, Jesus. He's giving you first swing, Chief. Come on. Stupid idiot. Oh no, the mind break tag is in effect. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Mind break. Like, it's just every single anime I've watched for the last several months has had, has had the mind break tag be in effect at least once. Christ, Thorfinn. Battle Horse! <laughs> Nephew! Imagine if he just called that out and Thorfinn just came to a fucking dead stop like, yo, what the fuck? He's gonna punch that horse! Yeah! Fucking just cunt punch that horse! Just... Oh. oh, Jesus Christ. He just saved Ascalad, Chief. But this is just kind of ridiculous, kiddo! <laughs> this is literally, he's literally just the anime rival that's just like, You don't get to kill him, only I get to kill him! Like... Uh All right. Time time to kill your family, Thorfinn. Yeah, no, let's go. With Thorfinn's stellar duel record, surely this will go well. Why is he putting the knife in his teeth? Is he got a plan for his other hand? Like... Oh no, he just wanted to pull his cape off like an asshole. Is he gonna bring up the fact they're related at all or not? No, that's the end. Okay. Oh... I feel like Thorkel's gonna get killed here because Thorfinn's an idiot. And that kind of bothers me. Like, I'm really, I'm really, I really don't want Thor Thorkel to die. I want Thorkel and Thorfinn to hang out, you know, have, you know, time together because, like I said, it's their, their uncle and nephew, you know? Like, like, Thorkel is... Thorkel's, like, at least from the comments, like, people have said, like, Thorkel's, uh, Thorfinn's uncle, you know? And... Like, the last time we saw Thorfinn actually be, like, a decent character was when he was back in Iceland with his family. You know? But he was kind of... foolhardy, and he just kind of didn't quite understand how the world worked, but he understood enough, and... 
Now, he was a dumb kid, but he was learning. It was like, he was that, he was a really good dumb kid. But the thing is, he went from dumb kid to edgy teen and didn't, and has not changed at all. Like, he's not a character. He's really not. So, like, my hope would be, like, connect him with his family again, you know? Maybe rebuild some of the shit that he lost, like, give him a surrogate father figure in this form of an uncle, which happened in Viking culture a lot, and maybe we could see him grow as a person, you know? Because, believe it or not, Vikings actually had pretty decent, like, family values. Like, like not like what we would consider family values, but, like, they had their own version of it, and it worked for them pretty well. Like, now you had, like, a lot of uh, adoption and, like, kids getting raised by uncles and shit like that. Like, you know, like, you know, yeah, it, was, it happened a lot, you know? Like, there was always this idea of having, like, a strong paternal figure for a warrior. And, and that's just kind of, that's just that's something that, like, Thorfinn is literally missing. And I think it's something that the show is trying to touch on a little bit, because Thorfinn hasn't had a strong paternal figure since he was a kid, and he's grown up to be an absolute fucking shit stain. So, maybe, maybe that's where they're going, maybe, maybe, possibly. But they also could just kill Thorkel right here, so... Could go either way, which would be very annoying if it does go that way, because... Mm. Mm. Um, fucking... Okay, but for this episode, though, I, I... I think it's really neat because it... it so, the lack... So, like, you're seeing, like, stuff of, like, a, more flashbacks of Ascalad's really nice. Like, I guess you get to see a little bit more of him. I'm kind of, but, like, I'm kind of concerned that he's actually crazy enough to think that Avalon is an actual real place and that he could just summon King Arthur. That's kind of fucking weird. And I'm also a little concerned that the whole, like, fact, the fact that, like, Ascalaz just, he literally did a Sylvanas and went, like, I hate you! I hate all of you! You're all sacks of fucking garbage! Fuck the Danish! And then Bjorn's like, no, Ascalaz's good boy! No, it's fine. Like, like Bjorn, he literally, like, says that he hates your entire race. Like, what's going on here, chief? You know, it's... I don't know, like... That's kind of... That's kind of weird, but okay. Um... Other than that, I mean, it's, it's just really, really neat. Like, I, I'm not a giant fan of the fact that... Armor only seems to function for protagonists. And I get the whole gimmick is supposed to be like, Oh man, he cut through... He cut through the armor! My god, not even my axe can do that! He's on some shit! But it's still kind of silly. Like, I get it, it's supposed to be like a Viking saga, so like, you know, and Viking sagas, shit like that does happen. But you can't have it both ways. You can't. Stop it. I don't know, it just bugs me with that. I mean, and not to mention the fact that also you've got anime bullshit in here as well. Like, either you're doing Viking Saga bullshit, or you're doing anime bullshit. Pick one. Like, I, it, it still bugs me the fact that they feel like they can do both, because, oh boy. Like, an anime bullshit is specking into a dex build. Viking bullshit is specking into a pure strength build. You can only do one. <laughs> Uh boy. Thor Thorkel's still really good. I, I like how he's just... He just really wants to fight. He just wants to fight. He wants to be a good Viking boy and fight. That's good. I like that. And and now that we've actually seen how they deal with surrenders, like, like in first... It's not just, like, wholesale slaughter. It's like, no, pick up your weapons. Fight, idiots. Like, that's pretty nice. That, that, that kind of clears up a little bit of ambiguity from before. And it just kind of shows that Thorkel's entire squad, they're just like, no, we just want to fight. We don't care about prisoners or fucking any of that shit. We just we just want to fight, guys. We're Vikings. It's what we do. Come on, idiots. Um, yeah, neat. And just the fucking like the like just Thorkel versus Thorfinn. Can't wait. Can't fucking wait on that one. Like fucking what was it? Like what Eska said. Like my god, this guy's a fucking idiot. He's a mouse challenging a bear. What the fuck? What is wrong with this man? Like I don't know. That that's cool. Uh, I'm I'm a I'm a big I'm a big fan of that. I'm a, I'm a big fan of just the fact that everyone's just like, the fuck. 
Of course, Thorfinn's uh, peerless dueling record will hold him through. Obviously, there is there is no way he could lose, right, guys? There's absolutely no goddamn way. Um, so what's probably going to happen is that Thorfinn is going to probably kill Thor Thorkel. My hope is, though, is that he loses. My hope is that he loses and Thorkel doesn't kill him, because you know. That's... that's murdering a family member, and that's a big no-no in every single... culture ever. Oh, uh, boy, um... And, like, if we could just get, like, kind of, like, Thor... I mean, there's no army now, you gotta, an ar you gotta have an army to cart around, otherwise, like, what the fuck you gonna do? Um... But yeah, having... having some time where Thorkel and Thorfinn can hang out and... You know, just be friends and be, f be family. That'd be nice. That'd be nice. Especially if he facilitates, like, Thorfinn killing Askeladd still, because... Like, Askeladd's made a pretty decent protagonist substitute so far. But it's not going to change the fact that he's not the, pr not the protagonist. Thorfinn is. And it's just been a matter of, well... We have to wait now. We have to wait until Thorfinn is at a point where he can, you know, where, where he can actually take up the mantle again and actually be a protagonist. Uh, but that's, that's how it be, I guess. It's just... I, I don't know, man. I don't know. Um, yeah. Yeah, good episode, good build up. I'm hoping they don't fuck it up. Like this show is, this show is, is this show is good. This show is. I I I really like this show. I think I say this a lot. I really like this show. I just there's always like one or two choices, like th for the narrative that just kind of tweak me out and just make me go. Mm. Mm. And I'm I'm hoping that shit turns out good. I'm hoping shit. She turns out Gucci, but it's how it be. It's how it be sometimes. But yeah, hey everybody, so let me know what you thought of this down there in the comments. Whether you like it, you dislike it, or you want to bring up something I missed, or some narrative element that maybe you think is gonna play into it, or maybe it's already played into it and I just haven't noticed, because that's entirely possible. Um, <clears throat> remember to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, share on social media, tell your friends, hit that share button down below. And if you want, you can always become a Patreon, patron, which is linked down in the description, along with a link to my Discord, and on the end card, which also has links to my other videos, which you probably want to watch, because those are pretty good. Those are pretty cool videos, I'm going to just say. Um, and if you do become a patron, you get access to my patron, to a patrons-only Discord channel on the Discord server, where you can basically, well, basically, I'm there all the time. Uh... And if, uh, so if you want to talk to me, the, page, the Discord's a, a good place to go anyway. But in the Patreon chat, you can recommend things to be Let's Played, Live Streamed, Let's Watched. Basically, like, you know, anything I do. And it goes on the list, and anything that's on that list, I have to work through eventually. So, yeah, big thumbs up for that. And also, if you're a patron, guess what? We, we, we have our Patrons Only Movie Night that we do once a month, usually the end of the second full week of any given month. So, the one for this month is going to happen on Saturday the 16th. And we usually just get in the Discord voice chat and our sync tube around about 6 o'clock Eastern Standard. And, yeah, we hang out, shoot the shit, uh, fucking watch some anime, play some video games, watch a movie maybe. Just kind of hang out, have a have a good old, grand old time. It's a, it's a big, big ups. Oh boy. Uh... And with daylight, with daylight savings time, oh boy, uh, I'd have to talk to some people, see if any, any times have changed, because I know America's... America, we got our funky clock shit, so that's great. But yeah, anyway, everybody, as always, I am Nozovix, and I'll see you in the next video. But most importantly, we've all become a trash mammal today, and I will see you a round of